Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Ender Lilies. Last time we left off, we got the A ending, basically. So that was interesting. And today we're going to see what else we, we can accomplish. We tried to fight uh, Night King Julius, but he kind of handed our ass to us a lot. Um, so I want to see if we can find any other things to get into. Um, just to see if, uh, maybe we can level up, find some new abilities, check out some new areas, etc., etc. I still don't know what the deal is with this place. Because it says there's something else in here, but I have no idea where that would be. So there's a door down here. Is this, is this one of the doors I gotta smash my way through, or is it one of the doors where... Um, it just says locked. I don't quite remember, but I feel like I should check it. It might even be one of the doors where... Um... Yeah, like, I can clearly see that it's something. But... Hmm. Yeah, like, we can clearly see that it's something, but I can't actually... It must be one of the ones we gotta destroy, right? Hmm. Okay, well, I need to find other things to get into because... Uh, I don't know if bashing my head against Julius right now is the best thing to be doing with my time. Like, I got very close on only my second try, but it feels like the guy just takes no damage. Um, so what other options do we have? We have that. We have this. There is a lot of uh, more stuff down there. And of course we can fill in uh, the areas over here. There's still this area way back there. I don't know if I could do something with that now or not. All right, you know what? Let's just start the episode off doing what I just said we weren't going to do, which is bash our head against Julius some more. Um, I don't know, man. I just want to try. So both of these are very useful. The music box is good. That's good. That's good. So yeah, I need all of these slots that I have right now, although I really want to be able to put the spellbound anklet on. But to put that on, I would have to take something else off. Hmm. I don't know what I would want to take off. Let, let me let me at least just see first how much better my movement is. I don't even really notice that much of a difference, if I'm gonna be honest. Like, I'm sure it is faster, but I don't really notice it. So, I may just not put that one on. We'll take that off. I want you on for sure, because you were quite useful. Hmm, and we need something to take up two more slots. Increases the potency of the healing prayer, and... Yeah, I mean, it seems like just the best thing to put on. And then, like, slightly more HP. Alright, well, I did get an HP upgrade. Um, since last time, so, I don't know, maybe that'll help. Let's try doing this for the first phase, and seeing if maybe it makes this first phase go faster, and, uh, I take less damage. Jesus, you attacked quickly there. Because you can't really attack me when I'm up in the air in this phase. I can't help but notice. You have a hard time hitting me in the air until the uh, next phase. So, it's definitely not making the fight go faster, I can tell you that. It's, uh, in fact, making it go slower. But, um... I am taking less damage. On the, for the most part, but... that may not hold true forever. I kind of... this with this setup, I just annihilate your... Whatever bar. Stamina bar. 
Yeah, Julius. Come on, man. I'm gonna run out. I'm running out of Elena attacks anyway. Uh huh. All right. I'm gonna switch to this Al. Should not have been hit by that. Uh huh. Come on, dude. Let me break your shit. Uh, huh. oh, God, I dodged at the wrong time. There you go. Um, boom. Okay, that was big damage. Uh-huh. Ow. Ow. Okay, heal. We don't. Uh-uh. That was pretty big damage. You did get me, though. Okay. Ow. Got caught by that one. Whew. Okay, we're doing all right. Oh, get out of there. Yep, that's the big one. That's the big one. We don't want to get hit by that stupid thing. Ooh! Okay, that was a good time to use that. That was a very, very good time to use that. Ow. Oh, I'm so close, man. I'm so close! I needed another dash. I wasn't gonna make it over him to dodge that stupid laser that he does. Okay, um, against this particular enemy, I'm gonna go ahead and say it. Elena doesn't seem super great. Uh, so... Let's try... get out of that. Let's try something else, I think. Um... What? I don't know, but... <laughs> Uh, something else. Uh... Hmm... I just don't know what. I really don't know what... ...is the other option here. Um... I guess you... Let's, let's try Silva. Let's try Silva. Let's give it a shot. God, I'm gonna have to get used to being this slow again, though. I'll only be able to get, like, one attack off every few seconds, basically. But, uh, I'm gonna have you guys helping me out, which will be nice. Like, this may be better for this phase, because I can just annihilate your stamina bar. Kablooey. That's not bad. Uh-uh. Yeah, it's- the damage isn't super high, but if I can build my special and just break your guard, um, I'll be able to do a lot. Uh, hit him with that. Okay. Uh, go ahead and activate that again. Okay. Yep, now you're on to this phase. So let's go. Uh-huh. Boom, boom, boom. Up. Oh. Okay. Let's just go ahead and pop it. Okay, you dodged it for the most part. Ow. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Kablooey! Okay, that was a bad time to use that, actually. Okay, but we're very good on health. Which I'm liking. I'm liking how good we are on health. Boom, boom, boom. I'm saving my special for a problematic moment, which I'm sure is going to come up in just a second here. Okay, yep, here you are in your next phase. Okay, you're gonna jump back and you're gonna do the uh, fire in your laser, right? All right. 
Oh, come on! He was inside of me, so it didn't work. Oh, that's bullshit. I'm sorry. That's some bullshit. He was inside of me. So my attack, uh, did not work. And then he gets, like, flung back during that one. Ow, jerk! Okay, get up there. Die, die, die. <sighs> My god, and then he- he gets, like, flung back from his own attack, so there's... Like, not a good way to guard against it. Honier is basically the only thing keeping me alive here. Okay. Get him, Honier! Ooh! Okay. Eat shit, Julius. Eat shit. Honier OP. Honier deserves an upgrade after this fight. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've only added, added to your burdens. You sure have, Julius. <laughs> you sure have. <laughs> but we did it. We did it. As the kingdom approached oblivion, its subjects became deathless abominations. My brethren fought on until madness consumed them, or the rain did. I managed to save off the corruption of my mind and found myself in the throne room. My blade held over the king I was meant to protect. He shook and blubbered in exasperation. The priestess and knights who gave their lives for the kingdom were, disp were disposable. This was where the king's obsession with immortality had led us. The king's words, dripping with greed, were the palpable lament of his corrupt heart. It was plain to me as the blood pumping in that heart also flowed through my veins. I, too, had not fought to protect the kingdom or its people, but my own interests. I only wished for him to admit he had been wrong to abandon me. Sure enough, as I held my sword over him, his eyes were fixed only on me. I had been waiting for this, waiting for our eyes to meet for the very first time. And that's the crown relic we have that does more stamina damage, which is interesting to note. And yeah, the king being an asshole and wanting the power of immortality or whatever is what spurred this whole thing. Knight Captain Julius unleashes a series of jabbing attacks with a lance that allows for maximum reach. Advancing thrusts can be made by using the skill while moving sideways. The king's bastard son. After enduring a hard life, he rose through the knightly ranks to get back at his father. His tenacity is unparalleled. And dash. After dodging, Knight Captain Julius grabs hold of you and charges forward, allowing a burst of momentum. After dodge, Knight Captain Julius charges forward, allowing... Yeah, okay. And that is probably how we get through those door things, right? Piercing Spectral Lance. While dashing, attack button. The charging strike of Knight Captain Julius' lance can break through pustulant walls. The longer the dash, the more magic builds up within the spear. This is not only increased attack range and power, but also... Yeah. Press X while dashing to activate Knight Captain Julius' charging strike, which can break postulant walls. Dashing over a distance allows magical energy to build. Yeah. Okay. We can finally get through those doors. A knight driven from the castle. How much hatred must one be consumed by to kill one's own kin? Well, the king was a giant dickhead that started this entire... Well, not this entire thing, but... He's a cause of the lo a lot of the problems, let's say that. <clears throat> because of greed and wanting to be an immortal and stupid shit like that. Okay, so... So if we... So wait, how do we actually do this thing? I thought it said during a dash, you, uh... Oh, but it has to be that one. Okay, I got you, I got you. Yeah, and then that. Okay, cool. Impaling Lily. It's got a achievement or whatever. Alright, well, uh, I'm interested in seeing what you're like, Julius. Um, we'll put you over here and rock you for a bit. Ooh, you are much slower than I imagined. 
Yeah. Uh, yeah, you're a lot slower than I imagined, Julius. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to admit here. Yeah, so after dodging, yep, while dashing, yeah. Okay, so that's, yeah, that's how that works, but, um... Advancing thrust can be made by using the skill while moving sideways. So, yeah, if I do this... Uh, we can do, like, an advancing thrust. But these are just little stabs. Okay, I mean, maybe you do a lot of damage or something, but... I, I, I'll keep you on just because you look awesome. How about that? I think that's a fair deal, right? You look super dope, so I'll keep using you for now. But we've got ourselves a new ability. So, okay, 317 is pretty high damage, but I kind of hate how slow you are, I'm gonna be honest. You're just too slow for my liking. But I said I was gonna use you, so we'll use you for now. There we go. We busted through here. That's just an amulet fragment. Um, that is not everything here. But what else do we got? Uh-huh. Yeah, you just attack a little too slow for me. I'm not crazy about that attack speed. Uh, what is your special, though? Oh my god, okay. Uh... That's like a variation of Honir's attack. Jeez. Alright. Um, so we gotta charge this up enough to be able to break through that, right? But how do I do such a thing? So, I don't know, maybe if I start like right here? And then, yeah, but if I jump, I lose it. Uh, might have to refresh myself on this to see. Because uh, the way I understood it, the more distance you have, the more magic power. Oh, okay, there we go. I just wasn't doing it right. King's Note 2. The fiend who stole away my beloved son is somewhere in the castle. I will not su suffer this trespass. My righteous rage shall not be satiated until I hunt them down. For I cannot allow a dynasty of royal blood to meet an end in mine own halls. Only my plans had come to fruition, but no. Hope yet remains. Yeah, uh, King's kind of a dick. Eldred's Ring. Speeds up accumulation of the SP gauge. That's very good. An ancient warrior's gift to a priestess. The two were quite close, despite him being a disembodied spirit and her his master. Though she has passed on, the warrior spirit yet remains, thinking fondly of the time they spent together. Well, that is quite good. Uh, that is quite good. Hi, nerds. There we go. Yeah, that attack speed's just... Righteously slow. Like, it is so slow, that attack speed. And, uh, I just can't handle that. Hmm, how do we access some of, uh... Because there's something else here. But what it is... Oh, I see you. You're what I'm missing. Okay. Boom. Boom. Did I get it? I think I may have gotten it. Maybe? Oh yeah, we got it. Cool. The rain changed everything. We have lost it all, leaving our pride. A hundred Furious Blight? Okay, hold up. We're getting more of this stuff now. Like, we're accumulating this stuff way faster now. Which I like, because that means that 800 number that I saw isn't so freakishly unattainable anymore. Um, so that ring, of course it costs three. That makes a lot of sense. It's quite good, after all. Alright, it's been good, Julia, uh, Julius, but, um... We're gonna go ahead and get back on our, uh, our old friend. So, later. I kinda liked Silva, I'm gonna be honest. Um, in that fight, but... Elena would've been better, but... 
It, it just, that just wasn't her fight, I feel. Other characters were just better, but... I don't know, Silva's, uh... Silva was doing pretty damn well, too. And since we're gonna be getting more of this stuff now, maybe, maybe Silva can make a bit more of a... a case for herself. Okay, I'm gonna have to ask you to die. Oh my goodness. Okay. The bluey. Dead Zo. Alright, out of here. Elena will smite you all. Okay, that's not where we need to go. Well, that's just rude. But Honier is probably gonna be the one I upgrade next, if I had to guess. Or Olv. One of them. They're definitely my favorites. They're my babies. I love them. Ah, yes. Uh... Okay, well, there we go. We broke through that. Even if they can't die, this is still slaughter. Yep. Uh-huh. And there's some more stuff hiding out over here still. That was one of the things, though. Ow. Yeah, I feel like Olv will be stupid powerful once I get uh, another attack speed upgrade on him. Like, that sounds... busted. Because he already attacks super quickly. So another one will just be actual insanity. Uh-huh. So... You go bye-bye now. And we're gonna find out where the rest of this jazz is in this level. Yeah. Jerk. Go away. Yeah, we did this last time, and I can't go any higher here. So that's not what I'm supposed to do. Hmm. Don't suppose we could go on this end and get up higher, though, right? Not really. Okay. Well, then. Where is the other secret thing? Here. I wonder. Hmm. Can't tell if that's like a weird texture or if that's something right there. Let me see. Uh, I don't know. It's like a weird texture. There's like a little bit of red sticking out right there and it made me think it was one of those walls. Hmm. Just really not sure where another secret could be. I don't know, man. Oh, you blocked all of those, friend. Usually the other guys let their guard down at least a little bit, but you did not. Uh... Hmm. Yeah, because this just leads up a floor, right? If I go right there... And this... Uh... Yeah, see, and this is something I can actually stick to. And there's a little bit of red sticking out. That makes me feel like it's something right there. But... Uh... Not sure how to make it work. I'm like almost hitting it, so it keeps making me feel like... I don't know, maybe... If I go up uh, to the next one and start it from here? But no, see, cause then... Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not totally sure if that's even what I'm supposed to be doing here. So, we're just gonna leave that for now. Later, friends. Okay, and then you're... Oh, no. I don't think I want to go down. I think I, in fact, want to go up. Because it looks like... There's some stuff up there. But I don't know how I would go about doing that. I don't suppose it's just killing all of you, uh, both of you guys, right? Hmm. 
All these hidden things that I'm having a ton of trouble finding. Dead. Oh wait, what is that? That looks like something right there. Uh, it looks like something, but I don't think it is something. Hmm. I think I'm just kind of seeing stuff where there's nothing now. Huh, okay, yeah, I'm kind of stumped on this particular area. We'll just leave it for now and go see what the deal with this was. Because there was a thing over here that we could do um, that I probably needed the ability to break a wall to do. Uh, ooh, give me that. Thank you. Uh huh. Oh, sorry. Yeah, there's like a right part of the wall over here that we could get to. Ow! Jerks. Yeah, over here. You're gonna fall off, dude. Look at you. And you, fungal mage, just need to go away. This is not your fight anymore. I have way outclassed you. Oh, this was just the store. Alright, well... Mm-hmm. Alright, down we go then. Down we go. There are other areas where I know I now have the ability that I need. So we can just, uh, focus on those. So, down. And let's see what we can get down here. Oh yeah, that thing that's gonna piss me off. Hmm. Uh, can you go away please? Random night friend. Thank you. Uh-huh. Is that nothing? No. I thought that would maybe be the solution, but uh, it appears not. That's the secret that's still hiding here. Yeah, I still have no idea about what to do with that. Alright, let's go see what we can find in other places. Because there are definitely other places. Like, uh, over here. Which we can now access this room. Because uh, that thing said to go talk to Night Captain Julius, and... Well, we didn't talk to him, but uh... We did something with him. We, uh, murdered him. You ready to die? Boom. Alright. Get a big charge going here. Kablooey. Now, this... What do you got for me? Snowdrop bracelet. Greatly reduces damage received from enemies. A bracelet made from snow flowers that blooms in chill climbs. Imbued with the prayers of a knight from the fort. Wreathed in sincerity and past memories. Okay. And that appears to be all that's over here, so... The other exit that I'm looking for is not that away. Go away. You guys are severely outclassed now. I will- I thank you for the level up, though. That I will take. That I will definitely take. Do I get to it this way? Ah, yeah, this is how we get to this exit. Cool. Since I can climb the wall now. And yeah, this is this place. And there was some more things we needed to find here. And I was like, where in the world could those things possibly be? And I still don't know where those things could possibly be because I didn't make it to the other side of the wall. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, let's get back up there. I think maybe I just needed to go down the left side of the wall. How much do you cost? Probably four? Yeah, of course. 
Okay, so... Nope, not over there. Uh, right there. Oh, let's go there. It's probably the best way to get over there. Alright. Yeah, there's a ton of stuff here that we needed this blast the wall ability to uh, unlock. So... Glad that we've gotten it now. Did I ever get uh, the stuff that was hiding up here? I did, right? Oh, I didn't. I never did. That's the thing that I'm missing here. Go away! Stupid birds, jeez. 30 Furious Blight. Cool, and that's everything here. Awesome. All right, get me out of here. And we're just gonna kind of climb down the uh, left side of the wall this time instead of trying to do a mad dash to the other side. Because, yeah, I think that's what it wants us to do. Maybe. Whew! Okay, never mind. What the hell? I th that's it. That's it right there. That's what we want to get. It's it's a break in the rock right there, but we need to time it perfectly to get in there at the right time. Okay, that's rough to do, but I will try my best. I will try my damnedest, I will. All right, back up. Uh, there. God, keeping track of all these places, man. There's too many. Let's try this one. Let's see if it's a little bit faster. Maybe. I don't know how this horse gets all the, gets to all the places it gets to, but... I really appreciate it. It's doing some nice work. Ow. Uh, activate? And then... Okay, that doesn't take me anywhere. Uh, yeah, this way is not going to be faster. I took the slower way. I took the slower way for sure. Oh well. We're almost there. Um. Yeah, then down here, and then over here, and then out the door, and we're good. Uh-huh. Past all the birds. Alright, just don't screw it up this time, and we're good. It's easy peasy. Alright, so... Yeah, we just gotta go down here a little bit. Ah, why could I not stick to that wall? Damn it. That wall was just curvy enough that I couldn't stick to it. I'm pretty sure this is what I'm supposed to do. And this is gonna piss me off immensely. Ugh. All right, I think I'll just cut until I get it now because we've, we've seen this run back a, enough times and yeah. Aha! Got you, damn it! Here we go. King of the First Ages Torn Note. Found a small girl in the Deadlands. She didn't speak, but fixed her gaze upon me as she clung desperately to me. I don't quite know what came over me then. Had I gone mad, wanting to bring back a child of the Ancients? Was it because she resembled us? Because she was a child? Or perhaps a sense of obligation? Perhaps I wanted my sins to be forgotten. King of the First Ages Torn Note. Yep, and a hundred stagnant blight. And these are also the flowers that we saw at the, uh, fount. Which is interesting to note. First Ages Torn Note 2. Though we once thought them completely wiped out, the ancients have returned. From the farthest reaches of the land they come, reanimated by the blight. Children of the ancients were revered and worshipped in Land's End's, Land's End as the White Priestesses. They're the only ones who could stave off the blight, and though I know full well the toll that purification places on their bodies, I could find no way to forestall their ultimate sacrifice. Another sin to add to the pile. Atonement now seems like a bitter seems but a bitter joke. So yeah, the the priestesses are the children of the ancients. And they're the only ones who can stave off the blight, and they it's really messed up what it does to their bodies and everything, but also the world's gonna end if we don't utilize them. So, uh, screw us, I guess. It's either make these children suffer and destroy their bodies slowly, 
Or let everybody else die. It's not really a good decision. But, uh, the king that originally came here, the one that invaded or whatever, was uh, kind of a dick. So that guy could have done some better things, but... Alright, I don't remember what was needed over there. I mean, right here, I'm pretty sure, was uh, one of the doors we have to bust through. Here and up, and I suppose we can try out that uh, other thing while we're over here. I think that's like the door thing that we need, though. Okay, you are not going to work like that. Huh. How am I going to get you to... Uh, oh, maybe like this? No, not quite. Hmm, I feel like we're getting really close here. Like, this feels like what I've got to do. Uh, so I've got to have just enough time to build up momentum. to, de uh, to Enough momentum to actually destroy that. Uh, go away please. I need this room for testing. If you guys don't mind. I really hope you don't. I'm gonna kill you anyway. Alright. Ah, that wasn't enough. Thought that was gonna thought that was gonna reach it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cause we can't jump, because jumping screws this whole thing up. Unless we do like this dash. But then yeah, you screw it up by doing that. Hmm. Ah, I just want to break you. But breaking you is hard. Yeah, you just- your stupid spear just is barely too short. Ugh. I hate it. I just can't get it to work. Like, that feels like it's enough, but I just can't quite... Okay, that one might have been better if I had waited a bit to charge there. Ugh, go away. There's something right there. I can see it and I want it, but I don't have the, like, distance I need to be able to charge it enough. If only you could, like, jump after doing it. If only, right? <sighs> that feels like what you're supposed to do, but I'm just... Just barely not close enough! God, you stupid spear, man! Just poke your arm out a little bit lo further! I hate you, Julius. You're really making me hate you here. Yeah, because it has to have enough to charge up, like, twice. Which is very hard to do with the amount of space I have. Because, yeah, that's only enough for the little baby one. If only you didn't, like, fall. God. Damn, it's so close. Like, is this- is this even how I'm supposed to do it? But I don't know another way to do it. Like, I can't come from the other direction. I don't think. There's no, like, way to get the platform to extend right here. If only this was, like, a full platform instead of this little bit that stops right here. Oh, wait, what is this? Wait, 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 wait. You can... Let's see, can we, can we like, fall down? From up there? Aha! Get out of here, you jerks. I think I found this before, actually. Uh-huh. 
There we go. Slightly increases the height of your jump. That was not worth it. Feather ornament Silva bequeaths her her doting sister, who never once wore it. Crafted by a sorcerer, it seemingly grants the ability to harness the wind. That was not worth it. What I just went through. I mean, it might be, like, required to get some, some stuff. I don't know. Bluey. Go away. Not dealing with you. Just not dealing with any of you guys. Ugh. You know what? Later. Bluey, 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 bluey. Go away. I just want to see if I can get this thing over here. Later, guys. Yeah. Do your little screams. I've got better things to do. Yeah, I couldn't- I can't remember what this actually required over here. Was it one of the secret doors? I think it was, wasn't it? Damn it, it was. It totally was. Yup. And we don't have what we need for that yet. Okay. Mm, can- I don't think you guys can kill me fast enough, can you? Got six damage. No, it's faster for me just to walk back to the the thingy. All right, and we got a little bit more that I can go ahead and check out now. I think, guys, go away, please. I really don't have time for you. I really, really don't have time for you. All right. Uh huh. Yep. And there we go. Cool. Bench. Oh, bench. How I've missed you. Yep, we got a relic. We're only missing three relics, it looks like. Which is cool. Um, let's go ahead and select that so it goes away. Alright, so. Ah, there's this. That's been bugging me forever. If I can just find out which one of the stupid things this is. Ugh. That one. <laughs> There's just so many. There's so many. Uh, oh yeah, I wonder if I can do this now. Mm -hmm. Oh, that did not work. That did not work. That was a mistake. Can you guys please do enough damage to kill me in a reasonable amount of time? That was pretty good. That was a good attempt. Yes, keep beating me up like that, please. Because I'm just trying to get back up there. I want to see if this thing does what I was I needed. One more. If this spider was better at his job, I would have died a little bit faster. But no, spider sucks at his job. Okay, so let's let's just go see what the deal is with this over here first because I'm pretty sure we just got to break through a wall over here And it gets me what I want Right Unless I'm crazy And it would not be the first time All right, so drop 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 bye die All right Yes! Good. That is what we needed. Okay, what do you got down here? Faden's letter. Oh yeah, this character. Found an interesting fragment from a stunned tablet. It seems to be engraved with an ancient spell. If I can repair and decipher the tablet, I may be able to call upon its magic. I must note that casting an unknown spell may lead to irreversible consequences. I don't think I should inform the king of this, at least not until all the fragments are recovered. Thus, I think it's best to leave it in your care. It's not safe here, and the other mages may catch wind of it. I'll be in touch should I learn anything new. Yeah, you were mentioned by, uh, Elena in one of your notes. Stone tablet fragment. The engraving can be deciphered upon collecting all seven fragments. Fragment of an engraved stone tablet with an ancient spell to be invoked once spoken. Assembling all the fragments will require a certain rite of magic. Okay, well... What in the world is that gonna do? We need seven of them? Seven, you say? Well, you've piqued my interest. I want to know what it does. 
Does it give me, like, the ultimate spirit or some shit? That's what I'm assuming. Hmm. Okay. 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 You've- you've got my interest. Ender lilies. Alright, let's give this another shot, why don't we? Uh, I screwed it up! Damn it, I- I was trying to do the charge. But I, like, pressed a different button instead. Some of these are, like, weird to implement, but it's mostly my ideas. Like, this may not even be the right thing that I'm supposed to do here, but it's basically all I got to go on. Oh, cool. Yeah, die. Poison water. Poison water is always really good at killing me. And we can just try this again. Hmm. I wonder if we're supposed to come from that other end over there. No. I don't think that would make sense. Hmm. Okay. Well, so sorry, sorry. Just thinking about puzzles while Lily dies in the water. Okay, but you don't propel me forward. That is a problem. Yeah, you don't propel me forward. That's kind of a requirement to make my plan work there. Uh-huh. So, yeah, that's not gonna work. Okay. Well. Uh... I want to do a little bit more this episode. I kind of just want to record a bit more. And since we've just been doing, like, you know... Checking out different things in the, uh, on the map. It feels like it makes sense to make this episode a little bit longer. Uh-huh. So, didn't we need to be able to, yeah. Okay, so we can go through here now. Mm-hmm. And I can bust through that. And I can also bust through this now. And we've already found everything there is to find in this room. Okay, this is just smash wall pustule heaven. Is what this is. You like- you like smashing pustules? Here's your area. Go away. Blow up, thank you. And kablooey. Kablooey? Oh, okay. Boom. Gotcha. Whoa, what are you even hanging on to, friend? Okay, that was weird. Alright, there we go. And... Kablooey. Oh, wow, I can actually kill you? Wait, I damaged you, didn't I? How did I do that? Weird. Is it because I came from so high up? Oh, I think that's it. So we can actually kill these things. We just have to use these things. Yeah, okay. Neat. Wow, this is quite the involved room, I'll, uh, I will say. Okay. Uh, all right. I should have charged that a little bit longer and I would have had it. I'm a fool. I did not mean to do that, but luckily it doesn't actually consume my heal if I accidentally press it. So, thank you for that. Uh-huh. There we are. Okay, this links back into this area. So this is just another way to... get in here. There was totally a secret up there, wasn't there? Somewhere? Yep. Found ya. 30 stagnant. Okay. And yeah, there's a secret right here. And what are you? Heretic's Mask. Greatly reduces damage sustained while in blighted fog and while in or on water. Mask worn by sorcerers entering the verboten domain. Provides protection against the poisonous miasma therein. So that is what we needed for this area. Verboten Domain Notice. To my esteemed colleagues, carrying out research in the Verboten Domain is an exciting prospect, but is also a dangerous one. All mages permitted to work in the Verboten Domain must wear the mandated masks. These masks are stored in the laboratory. They are limited in supplies to treat them with care. 
Okay, cool. So we need to put that thing on. So new relic. It takes one slot. That's annoying, but whatever. So now I can just dive into this water and be like, yum. Death water. Excuse me, is that? That looks like something, right? Hmm. That doesn't work though. We can't we can't do that going down. Okay. Okay. Well. We're in the verboten domain now. So I think we're gonna go ahead and end this episode off here. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Ender Lilies, and I will see you next time.